It's a beautiful day here in the villages in Central Florida. And actually, you know what? <laughs> it's overcast. It's a little bit humid. But uh, <laughs> but regardless, it's still, it's, it's a beautiful day to be looking at open houses. And that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to share with you this property right here that was in the morning the morning paper. This property is, if I can find the... Uh, the little hit thing here. This is 5602 Tome Loop, and this is a lot Lan Lantana 32 in the village of Hawkins. And uh, we're gonna go in and just do a uh, do a little walk and talk through this property. The property is listed at seven hundred and thirty-eight thousand dollars. So this, my friends, is what seven hundred and thirty-eight thousand dollars will get you in the villages. Okay, now it's interesting comparing this to properties that I've been looking at in other parts of the country, such as the uh, the Kalispell area. So I want to I want to contrast this to what uh, what I've seen in other places. So as far as elevation goes, nah, it's average. I you know, I wouldn't I wouldn't necessarily drive down the street and say, "Ooh, look at that house." You know, I might. I don't know, but uh, but anyway. So this is the uh, this is what's known as the elevation of the property, if I'm not mistaken. Now, one thing that I've learned from uh, Skip Smith in the villages is, you know, you want to get a house that has a uh, like a, a golf car garage, such as this has. You see over here, they've got a little little garage, and that's where the golf car would be stored. And I'll give you a nice little pan looking around the the neighborhood. So you see, this is what your uh, this is what your neighborhood would look like. Now that home over there, if you could see it, I kind of like that a little bit. That's got some uh, uh, more of a grandeur type of a uh, you know elevation. But let's go ahead and we're going to walk in and and take a look. I already told the the realtor that I was going to come in, you know, with the uh, with the camera blazing and and do a. Uh, do a tour. There's your there's your front door. It's got a nice nice front door. Okay. Wow, they got a they got a really large large area here. Look at this. Now the floor. I don't know if this is real wood. I don't I don't think that it is. This is probably that that laminate stuff that you would see on a floor. A lot of the homes that I was looking at out west, those homes were uh, the, the real deal when it came to when it came to the floors. You know, w real wooden floors. Kitchen here is rather rather big. Look at that. Look at that kitchen. So you got a rather rather large kitchen. Very interesting. The key features of this home, it's got uh, oversized garage, two car plus with golf car garage, walk-in shower in the master bath and large residential lanai and quartz countertops. That's what you're looking at. You're looking at quartz countertops right there. And I see that they've got gas. That's one of the first things that I always look for is gas. Here's your, your kitchen cabinetry. You can see right, right there, I'll give you a Try to give you a nice view of that. Seven hundred and well, seven hundred thousand plus is what will uh, what will get you into this home here. No pool. They don't have a. There's no pool here. So let's go and take a look at the uh, at the bedrooms. The, uh, let's see here. So this here would be, well, this would be a guest bedroom, I would imagine. This would be one of the, one of the extra bedrooms. I like the colors. I like the, I like the color that they chose to, uh, to paint, the, paint the, this home with. So that's one bedroom. I'm assuming now this would be the, this would be the second, second bedroom right here. So here's your second bedroom. I also kind of look for the, the closet space, you know, to see just how big, how big the closets are. 
And I'm assuming, well, here's the bath. So this would be the bath for those two rooms. Okay, and then we'll come out. Master bedroom, I'm assuming the master bedroom must be right up, right up here in the front. And my assumption would be, my assumption would be correct. So this would be the, this would be the master right here. And I think they have a, uh, I think they have a walk-in shower. A lot of the places here in the villages are going to forego having a tub because as you get older, you know, it's a little bit challenging for, for some to, to be able to get in and out of a tub as opposed to being able to walk into a shower. So there's your, there's your shower right there and your toilet. So to me personally, this home lacks the, uh, it lacks the sense of elegance, you know, elegance. I don't, I don't get that, that, that sense of, uh, of elegance in this home. And then, you know, you can sit out here. Looks like you can sit out here and here's the uh, large lanai. It's got a very large lanai out here. So you could sit out here and count cars going up and down the interstate off in the distance. You see, and the occasional truck. There goes an Amazon Prime truck down the highway. So, you know, you could, you know, sit here and throughout the day count how many times you see an Amazon Amazon Prime truck truck coming coming down. But uh, okay, folks. So that is the uh, that's the tour of the home. And now we'll go take a uh, quick peek inside the inside of the garage over here. No fireplace. I don't see a uh, fireplace. You'd be hard hard pressed to tour a home out in Montana and not see a fireplace, albeit a uh, a gas or a, a gas or a uh, or a natural wood burning fireplace. So here's your garage. Right here. All right, so there is your tour onto the next property. His and her closet. And here is the next home on the uh, Saturday open house tour in the villages. This is the Iris, and Sue Smith was just saying, now this is the home that she wants. So <laughs> we're going to take a walk through here and see if this home grabs me as much as the as the gardenia did. So I don't know if this home is is furnished. I'm assuming that this is a a model home, but uh, we will see as the saying goes. Well, hello. Look at this. This is very nice also. How are you? I'm good. Catching you sitting on the job. <laughs> this is her model home. This is her favorite. This is Sue Smith. And we were just looking at the gardenia, mm -hmm. and I really like that. And uh, Haley up there was telling me that home, as is, would sell for about 866 This one is going to probably be over a mil. This one, the same over price? Mm -hmm. About the same price? No, yeah, probably over a mil. Yeah, over a million. Over a million. You've got a pool here. You've got your 10 foot ceilings. Okay, so this home would sell for over a million. I love the kitchen. I really, really love the kitchen here. Very, very nice. And I can, uh, we'll just take you for a nice walk. Now that both of these have a, uh, have a rather nice view. And I'm trying to discern the difference of the cost between this one and, uh, and the gardenia. Just the gardenia. Now look at this. You see, this is, look at the pool here. It's almost like a jacuzzi. Look at that. Very nice. Boy, I have some friends over. You could have your brekkie right there. You see? I could have a beautiful breakfast right there. Wow. I don't know. I think I might even like the, the view from the other 
other home better because it's it's less obstructed here you've got some some beautiful trees and I don't know if you can see all the little lizards that's something that I haven't seen a lot of out west these the the lizard problem here has just gotten out of control you see everywhere you look now I guess you could if you like lizards you could probably throw some lizards on the Barbie you know and have some uh, some lizards and, and, and prawns, you know, but uh, very, very nice. I almost, but I think, I think the other one had a, a little more sense of, of being cozy. And the gardenia both are always our top sellers. The yeah. gardenia iris are always the classics. When I only looked at the uh, lantana because it was so Look at rich. that. But that one didn't have a good use. Very nice. Now this one's got tile floor, as opposed to the, uh, I think it might have been laminate floor. Over there. There's your garage. Uh, very nice. What is the difference in cost? Why is that home 150,000 less than this one? This one actually has a bit more. Um, you've got a three foot stretch on both sides and uh -huh. the front, and your lanai is bigger. Okay. You've got a much bigger lanai. And I also think that the view is probably a bit different. It is, it's a little bit yes. different. It's more obstructed. The other one's open, whereas yeah. this one, you've got the trees. You've got a but view, you... yeah. Okay, and this one's got more lizards. Yeah. I've seen I've seen more lizards, you know, around this property than than I saw I on. No, I can't stand those things. On the on the other, you yeah. know, but uh, look at the bedroom here. I don't know, you know, but to be quite honest with you, I might. Uh, you like the gardenia Well, I haven't I haven't finished walking through, but mm -hmm. so far I kind of like the the other property a little bit better. Yeah. yeah. And that's my goal in life is to never have to clean a shower door. So <laughs> yeah, the other so, one was else so you wouldn't have door. to wouldn't yeah. have to close clean the shower door. And the other had a his and hers closet, and this one just has a. That's house. right. The other one did have a his and hers closet. And this one's just got one large, yeah. large closet. Wow. Very nice. Now let's go take a look at the. The other bedrooms. Now, as opposed to, as I was saying, when I was looking at homes out west, mm -hmm. all the homes out west would have fireplaces. Mm -hmm. And the homes down here, you know, the fireplace just doesn't necessarily conform with the, uh, with <laughs> the environment. Now, look at that propeller. You see, they took a propeller and mounted that up there, you know, for the ceiling fan, <laughs> interestingly enough. Is it very nice? Yes, it is. And we'll go look at the, uh, Sue was just saying that the decor is very nice here. Wonderful. And here's a, uh, here's one of the, the two, two of the three bedrooms right here. Uh -huh. Carpeting. Nice office. Here is a, an office. Look at that. Yeah. Let's see? Rather nice. Quite honest. It's very, very nice. Boy, it'd kind of be a toss up between the, uh, between the two. Mm -hmm. As far as the uh, home that I would like. Yeah. Here is. Look at this bathroom here. Very nice. And that's what's in my base drawback would just be the, the glass doors you have to clean. <laughs> yeah. All right. <laughs> Wonderful. All right. So there is your, uh, your iris model here in the villages. Very nice. Beautiful, beautiful home. 2678. This is the, the second home here on the uh, Saturday open house tour in the villages and this home looks nice now this is a uh, 
this is the model home so I can't can't give you the price on this home this is the the gardenia model and I, I wish I could give you a price on this but uh, this is one of those type of uh, homes where you know they've tricked it out with with all the bells and all the whistles with the exception of the the beautifully designed uh, you know the uh, I don't know what they call that on the driveways when they when they come in and paint paint the driveways but uh, I wish I could give you a price but oftentimes they'll they'll trick these homes out and uh, and in doing so then you know the price is significantly higher than what you might ex what you might expect or hope hello how are you Good. this is the model home yes this is the gardenia the gardenia yes. oh it's very nice <laughs> is this home for sale this actual home can i buy this home today no this is a model home so one of our many on this street that are just for show but we furnish them so you can see what it looks like with furniture uh -huh. inside and if I were to buy this home when it's done being the model, because at some point in time you will sell this home, right? Mm -hmm. What would this home sell for? This entire home with the furniture, because we have to sell them with furniture inside, uh -huh. is about eight seventy. Eight seventy. Mm -hmm. Really? Let me look up the exact numbers for you. Not bad. Okay, so she's going to get the exact number, and I'm going to complete my tour. I actually like this. This home is. Uh, is very nicely decorated that that's one of my biggest challenges when it comes to thinking about buying a home you know going down to going down to a place like ross dress for less and and going through all of the knickknacks and trying to find just the right stuff to put you know on the uh on the countertops and and what have you but uh it's 866 357 856 furnished 866. Furnished. Yep. So if I write you a check right here and now, will you take it? <laughs> I wish. <laughs> okay. Once these hit the market, though, I would be happy to help you. <laughs> Look at this. How long does it usually take? So for 866. A couple of years. I mean, we this could, really could all be all be yours. I like that they have gas. It's our designer homes. Very, very nice. So the other well, this would be the, I think this would be the master right here. Yeah, nice. This is a nice, uh, this is a nice home. Nice master, master bedroom. Very, very nice. And to be quite honest with you, I'm kind of surprised. I, at eight, 860 something, look at the, here is the, uh, there's the bedroom or the uh, the closet. One of two, one of two closets. I actually thought that she was going to tell me this home would be into the nine hundreds, if not over over a million. But uh, let's look at the at the bathroom here. Okay, there's your walk-in shower. Somewhere is the shower head. Whoops, right there. Not bad. Very, very nice. Very, very nice. Nice cabinetry. Wonderful. Boy, to be able to walk right into a home like this, like all the furniture, like all the decor, you know, I mean, that is, uh, that's ideally what I would like. Here's the, here's the bathroom, or the, uh, the washroom, I should say. Come out here. Take a look at the, at the garage. Yeah, there's your garage. Very nice. Wouldn't surprise me if Sue Smith likes this home also. <laughs> I do. Do you like this home, Sue? You know I do, yes. I'm trying to hide behind this so y'all can take pictures. <laughs> wow. What do you like about this one? Well, I, I like the decoration. I like the colors. Mm -hmm. I like the layout, too. The, the, home, the home has a certain amount of elegance to it. You know, I, I want a home that has a certain amount of elegance, a certain amount of grandeur. Right. 
uh, yet still retains a certain level of, of coziness. Right. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. So it's very, very nice. Yeah, the crown molding at the top is so nice. It just finishes it off so well. And look at the outside. This is nice here. Boy, look at this. Very, very nice. I'm going to give her my phone number and tell her to uh, tell her to, to call me when this home becomes available. Look at the pool. You see? Now I know if I bought a place like this in the village, a Skip Smith would probably be over here all the time. You know, he'd probably be coming over saying, what do you, what's going on today? What are you doing? What do you want to do? Isn't this a beautiful view, though? It's beautiful. Yeah, it is. It I is. like it. So this is the kind of place, Sue, that I could walk in if she said it was available, that mm -hmm. I might just write a check. Yeah. You know? Well, I mean, you know, I'm sure they have them. Uh, uh -huh. This particular one isn't available, but I'm sure they have them. You in do. other places. Uh -huh. Wow. Look at this. Very nice. Now, the one thing again I don't like is you're sitting there watching TV and you're looking at the wall of your next door neighbor. You know. Close the blinds. <laughs> I know. Close the blinds. Yeah. You know, you don't see your neighbor out, out this way. Yeah. You know, you don't see the neighbor out that way. But there's that. Let's go take a look at the uh, at the other bedrooms. Mm-hmm. Look at this. There's one of the one of the guest bedrooms. Again, very tastefully decorated. Let me see the sink in here. I bet I bet Silvana would, would see this and just uh, love it. Look at the sink. Isn't that beautiful? Yeah. Very nice. Boy, I really like this home. Mm -hmm. I really like this home. And this is your round room. <laughs> I'm sorry? I said, this is your round room that you like. Uh-huh. You know? Yeah. yeah. This is not for sale. Go right. back so into the kitchen. Oh, Here's your kitchen. Of Plenty of room. Mm -hmm. All right, folks, maybe we'll try to sneak in one more, uh, oh, one more uh, home so on the tour. Don't